now where former President Mohamed Morsi has been sentenced to 20 years in prison. He was on trial along with 12 other members of the Muslim Brotherhood for the torture and killing of opposition protesters. But it's only one of several cases against the ousted president. CCTV's Adel Al Mahluhi reports from Cairo. The sentencing lasted just four minutes. Ousted President Mohamed Morsi and 12 other Muslim Brotherhood members received 20 years each. As a representative of the injured protesters, the verdict was satisfactory, but definitely it was not for the families of those killed in the 2012 protests. The accused were found guilty of resorting to violence, abductions and torture during protests at the presidential palace. But the judge found no evidence of premeditated murder. We were surprised with the innocence verdict of the murder charges. For us, we were only concerned with the separation of our civil rights case. It will be investigated in a court with proper jurisdiction. The Brotherhood's lawyer wasn't willing to immediately comment following the judgment. I don't want to comment on the verdict. I must review the reasons and document first. I apologize. The defendants themselves were defiant in court, applauding the judgment and waving to the media. If you look at them, many were dressed in blue, meaning that they've already been found guilty in other trials. Some of them were sentenced to a triple life sentence and the others to death. So this verdict is meaningless. They think that at a point, they'll be able to strike a political deal and the charges will be dropped. I don't think this will happen. Uh, it was the first time authorities allowed the media inside the police academy to film a trial. Still, no one caught even a glimpse of the former president. For a similar case to Mubarak's killing of the January protesters, Morsi have received a lighter sentence. The defense will appeal, and according to the Egyptian law, if that is accepted, Morsi and his colleagues will definitely get a lighter sentence. Adel Mahroui, CCTV, Cairo.